10 minutes to go to land the Nada. I'm by myself. Fred's back to California on an airplane. The Mumbles man has got honeydews. And Beaver is ahead of me about a half hour. He's going to the northern area. I think that I'm going to go right back from where we were. I was going to go to the north. The ones that went to the north yesterday, you saw beaver stuff. They, they found a lot more towers than we did. You know, more clad and stuff like that. But I don't know. I may go that way, but I, I'm thinking I'm not. We have to see. Stand by. You did change my mind. I went north, 33rd Street. Stand by. There's old King Neptune right there, you see him? Wow, he's big too. Well, you can see it's very little waves today. I like it. Got some scallops. Stand by, let's see what 33rd Street does for us. Well, the tires got off good. When the waves get off, you can almost get off in this little slough right here. Got 12.15 right there, I gotta stop. That's Doc Beaver. Two of this 12.15. I got a couple of them babies. And see how Doc Beaver's making out here. I'm wearing a wetsuit and flip flops. Just just bottoms. <laughs> just a farmer John. <laughs> I ain't got nothing. Some sunglasses and some aluminum and found a uh, button back down at the uh, floor there. It's, uh, it's not it's not marked, but it's got uh, like some design on the back of it there. Oh, yeah. Some rings. And then you can see the inside of it, how it's put together, so it's kind of cool. Yeah. Anybody else out? Not that I know of. It's just crazy, guys. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful out, man. Yeah, it's nice as you want. Still... Especially, you can almost get down in there waves. Oh, I, I have the, been. When it's, the waves drop off. It's a little, little... I figured it might be something right here at this point. A little, little chilly when you get a little close to the pack. This point was here yesterday. I just never got up I, here. I, I got it. I... I was I, I got down here yesterday. I didn't find much up in there. I mean, it might have changed now, but I went along the edge here. I didn't get into that spot. You've got the pants on. You should get right in there. Yeah. Well, let's see how it goes. All right. Man, see, this is this little drop off is right there, and the waves aren't too bad, but they're coming in spurts, so you get two or three minutes without a wave hardly. That's nice. I like that. I can't prove it may have helped anything. I just like it. It drops off right there. Right there's a little slew. This is like a little point on the beach right here. That's a good sign, generally. Stand by. You see, I'm right in it now. It's about a little over knee deep. There's the break right there. I hope you can see it. 
and the waves aren't too bad. They're just kind of rolling, rolling in here a little bit. There's the break right there. I know you can see that. A drop off or a flue or whatever the hell you want to call it. That's not many targets. Doc Beaver just found a cell phone. Looks brand spanking new. And a message in a bottle. <laughs> More to follow. There you go. Damn. A lot of work for a pull tab. I dug my first first target I got was like that damn pair of sunglasses. Holy. I thought I never would get it out. Maybe that's what they are. I'm probably pushing them further in. <laughs> Oh, liar, liar. Oh, it's one of those, does the old, yeah, I feel bad for the kid right now. I don't even know his status, but the kid that got close off of our team last year, Kalen LeBoren, who's playing, uh, playing for him, he got hurt, uh, uh, he got hurt the last game, and I don't know what happened. The bottle caps I do, they disappear, and then sometimes they'll come back. I hate them. Finally, it's a bling. Bling with ice. That's a big stud, isn't it? Ah. 24 carat. Yeah. That's right. 24 carat crap. Well, I don't think we're going to have any yellow to look at tonight. Mumbo's man didn't go. Just me and Beaver. And Beaver didn't have anything unless he found something after we left him. But he was picking up some stuff. He had a, like I said, you'll see a cell phone and a what else did he have? He had something else. I forgot. You'll see it though. I did find a dime. I thought I found a penny, but I don't see it in any place. But I could have swore I found one penny. Bunny. But ice. It's terrible when that's the best of it, eh? <laughs> God, Mumbles, man, get back to work here, man. We got to see some yellow. Can't be taking days off like I did. I got, uh, I won't be spending Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday. I got Canyon duty. Canyon has got, I got to take him to swim in tomorrow. I got to pick him up after school. So I'll be three days with Mr. Canyon. That'd be cool. We'll see how that goes. Stand by. I got some knives. I know I got a uh, some knives coming in. I don't know. I think around eight. I'm not sure if they're coming today or tomorrow. Hold on a minute. Be able to see this or not? It's dark in here. This was a big crate we had when we first got Jack when he was little, and we never did get rid of it. So we put it in here, and Dottie goes in it now. Dottie's crate. We put it in the back of the car when we picked her up, and it's been her crate. However, the last four, five, six days, Jack has taken over the crate. I guess he figured it was his when he was little, and he's just taking it back over now. I have a hard time. Every time we turn around, he's in the crate running her out. So we found one on eBay. Not eBay. What do you call it? Craigslist. And we're going to put it over here. I guess we'll put Dottie in that one and let Jack... <laughs> Take over his old crate, that dummy. I guess he misses it or something. I don't know. He ain't been in it in 10 years. He's been in the garage for 10 years. Or maybe longer. I don't know. At least 10 years. Jack's funny. Okay. That's it. See you someday. Soon. Good luck to everybody. Cut off, you turkey. Man, I got some bad news here. Look at that. No more best of it till summer. God.